I never met the man, but he's a brother, because we're all police officers. And we had a brother that was killed, and we're here for him today. Just standing for our, our first responders and our veterans. We honor and respect the job they do for us every day. Uh, my close to family, uh, Captain Dorn, I met him about, oh man, 25 or more years ago when I got the military. I was thinking about becoming a police officer and uh, he talked to me. He talked to me and uh, that's how I remember him. Just pay my respect. Really nice man. I'd just like to say that he was very well loved. I've known him for a while. Uh, he was one of one of my captains when I worked for the police department, and very good boss. He did everything. You know, he could, he would do anything for you. And when I first got to the department out at Area Three, he made me feel very welcome. He was an outstanding individual, an outstanding public servant. I'm sorry that uh, people. Uh, the individuals who did this uh, crime did not realize that they should have been out doing what they were doing. So I'm sorry that we lost the person of the statue, Captain Dorn. My neighbor, every day he walked his two dogs past my house at 6.30 every day. Every day he walked two white dogs past my house every day. And he was a fine neighbor and an and a officer. Um, and I know his son very well. Divorce. Grew up in playing baseball in the community. Charges filed late this afternoon in the murder of retired St. Louis Police Captain David Dorn. Captain Dorn was shot to death last Tuesday while he was on security duty at Lee's Pawn Shop. Surveillance video helped lead homicide investigators to 24-year-old Stefan Cannon. He's now charged with first-degree murder, robbery, burglary, and armed criminal action. He is currently being held without bond. A second man. 27-year-old Jimmy Robinson is charged with burglary in that case. His bond has been set at $30,000 cash only. I saw um, the video of him being shot, and it just really stirred something in my heart.